nightlights of the world's greatest gambling city, Las Vegas. The city in the desert, the city that never sleeps. Here you can gamble 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. And if you're lucky enough to be there in a leap year, you can gamble for 366. And the signs, they blink, they wink, they flash in different colors, and one of them even talks. There are 12 multi-million dollar hotels along the Las Vegas Strip. And yet 60 years ago, you could buy land for less than $1,500 a lot. Now the total value of land and buildings is $800 million. Competition's keen, and gamblers always welcome. This cowboy not only doffs his hat, he says, Howdy, partner. The name Fremont is famous here. But how many tourists know that it was Captain John Fremont who came here in 1844 and wrote of a camping ground which he called Las Vegas, meaning the Meadows. He'd notice a bit of a change now. 64,000 people live here and tourists flock in from all parts of the world. There are lavish stage shows and floor shows as well as gambling to entertain them. When daylight comes and the quarter million dollar neon sign goes out, the gambling goes on along the six miles of highway that run through the city. There are four major highways converging here and another freeways under construction. In addition to the 12 major resort hotels, there are 36 commercial hotels and 275 motels, a total of nearly 13,000 rooms. Las Vegas, of course, is a city in the desert. It gets only three and a half inches of rain a year. But it has more swimming pools than any other comparable resort in the world. They do things in a big way here. Of course, you can afford to when you have a revenue of more than a hundred million dollars a year. Twenty-one million people come here every year. Their hotel rooms cost them from $12 to $100 a day. They can gamble, swim or play golf on one of the four 18-hole courses. Oh yes, it is the middle of the desert, but there are water hazards on the golf course just the same. This is Las Vegas, the greatest gambling city in the world. A glittering skyscraper city that's a world in itself.